Nendra everyone. Today we are going to make a very interesting rangoli. Rangoli not with colors but something very unique and different. So let's start. For this rangoli you need a poster board like this, a compass if you have a compass or you can use uh, circular objects like this small bottle that I'll be using for a bigger circle this bowl which has a uh, which is also round a sharpie a pencil an eraser and also a ruler for drawing the square so first of all we'll use the small circular bottle and make a small circle outside i'll be drawing a bigger circle using this board now using the ruler i'll be drawing a square outside these two circles you can make a point if you want it to be perfect now uh, on the middle of each line of the squares i'll be drawing petal like figures this is going to be a free hand drawing guys just imagine to draw petals on all the four sides also on the corner of the square i'll be drawing another four petals so there will be total eight petals in all. Now using this small bottle again, I'm going to draw circles within all the eight petals. So you can see how am I, I'm doing this. So this is how our final project is going to look like. I'm going to decorate it with the, these different dals or lentils that you can see like rajma, masoor, rice, uh, tuar dal, moong dal, all these dals that we eat daily in our food. And this what you see is the homemade glue that I have made using atta and sugar. This is what is being used in this project. Eco-friendly. Take the homemade glue and uh, on the outer circle just apply a layer of glue. On this circle I am going to uh, stick our rajma or kidney beans. So apply the glue properly. Now take the rajmas and stick on top of it like this. Now in the inner circle again I am taking our biodegradable uh, home glue, applying it all inside the circle and on this circle I am going to stick rice, the small rice that I have, white rice, I am going to put it on this circle and don't worry if the rice comes out because we can always remove the excess but make sure to apply the glue properly. Now take some rice and put it on the circle and then make sure to tap it properly. Press it down so that it actually sticks and whatever extra is coming out we can always remove it so don't worry about it. Now similarly on all these small circles I am going to apply glue and put our white rice. So this is how my all the eight circles are finished i have put rice now i'm going to remove the excess rice now in the center circle like uh, the area between the rajma and the rice again i'm putting some glue good enough quantity of glue and then i'll be putting moong dal on top of it so we'll stick moong dal the green whole moong dal in this space can you see this yeah so put it all in the middle portion and make sure to press it then i've taken the red tuar dal and this i'm going to stick in the square portion so i've i've applied glue in the whole square section and i've taken the red masoor dal and spreading it all across making sure to press it also in between and now i'll remove off the extras of the dals in a tray or any place you want to so 
all the extra will come out whatever is stuck will be stuck now similarly i'm putting the yellow thuar dal in the middle petals outside the sur white circle but make sure to put good amount of glue put the dal press it and don't worry about the extras because we can always remove it similarly i've taken the um, a brown masoor dal and that also i am going to stick uh, in the corner petals so i have taken brown masoor dal and the green moong dal and that i have stuck in the this is how a final product is going to look like a beautiful homemade dal rangoli and this is absolutely eco friendly biodegradable vegan harming not a, uh, it's it's not harming our environment in any way and it looks so beautiful and this you can use it as a rangoli as well as like a wall hanging jai jinendra